Welcome to the October 30th episode of Palm Valley News. I'm Xander and here are this week's announcements. With the cancellation of the fall festival, the Palm Valley Parents Association has come up with a new fundraiser. Holiday wreaths will be sold to raise money for the school. Keep an eye out for paperwork about the fundraisers in the next few weeks. The Parent Association is putting on a drive-in movie night on November 7th at the Westfield Mall. Incredibles 2 will be shown at 6 p.m. in the third level parking garage. The price is $40. A link will be emailed to all parents to sign up. Here is a movie review of the classic 1933 movie, King Kong. Hi, I'm Indy, reviewing yet another movie. Today we are going retro and reviewing 1933's smash hit, King Kong. King Kong is sometimes called the father of Jurassic Park and alien type films, and for good reason too. The movie uses every trick in the book to create its illusions, using live action, back projection, and stop motion animation, as computer generated graphics had not yet been invented at the time this film was created. The movie was directed by Marion Cooper and Eris Skiadzak, and was produced by the legendary David Selznick. Although it has the scope and feel of an expensive epic, King Kong had a relatively low budget of about 600,000. Faye Ray's character Anne in King Kong stars a Long Kong. The score sound effects are without a doubt fantastic for a movie made in 1933. Overall, I give this film four indies. Back to you, Xander. Here's Mateo with a preview of sports this weekend. There are a lot of exciting sporting events this weekend. In the NFL, the Los Angeles Chargers are playing against the Denver Broncos, and the LA Rams are traveling to Miami. In college football, the big game of week is number five, Ohio State, taking on number eight, Penn State. Mr. Killings, Wisconsin Badgers battle Nebraska, and Mr. Williams, Indiana Hoosiers travel to New Jersey for their game against Rutgers. That is all for Palm Valley News. Remember to follow us on social media.